Hi guys, welcome back to Impossible. So, um, first and foremost, I would like to say that if you're sensitive, um, please go to another channel. My channel is only for the real, okay? Uh, Tasha really doesn't give a fuck what she says on this channel, all right? Thumbs up, like, subscribe, all right? Next up, I'm doing Cancer Man, Gemini Woman. <laughs> These two motherfuckers right here. Uh, I'm going to tell you this off the back, highly, 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 uh, addictive sexual relationship going on here with these two, um, uh, two moody motherfuckers, um, that's for sure. Um, but this can actually, um, work. They can actually balance each other out if they get past a few obstacles, which I'm going to talk about. But remember, part twos are coming out for these compatibility reports as well. Okay, let's begin. Cancer man, Gemini woman. So here, water meets air. <laughs> Cancer man is gonna like Gemini woman that she's out. Uh, you know, she's free. She's a conversationalist. She's a go getter. She knows what she wants. Okay, and you know, Cancer man. You know, he's a conversationalist. But in and out, like when he starts to get to know someone, he will talk here and there, but he's more quiet and laid back and in the cut, he's more of a, of a listener, very funny. She's gonna like his humor, she's very funny, and they're gonna learn, you know, uh, in time, you know, it's gonna develop into something very nice, but let's get. So in the beginning, yeah, they meet each other, cool, we're gonna go out, like, hey, let's have, to have fun. He likes Gemini, you know, that she's moved here, there, everywhere. You know, uh, he's more reserved and laid back, you know, in the cut. And, you know, mysterious. She's going to like this mysterious uh, way about him in the beginning. He's going to like her here, there, everywhere in the beginning. Okay? What he's going to like about her uh, the most is going to be uh, the fucking part. Okay? Because Gemini woman is very, very, very freaky and nasty. You know, what about the toys? Let's do this. And he's going to love her free uh, mind and sexual uh, endeavors in the bedroom. Yes. Okay? Now, these are two moody motherfuckers. Yes, they are. All right? But it's just getting to understand each other because they could really, really balance each other out. It's just getting there. Okay? So, Cancer Man, he's a boss type kind of man. If they both evolve, this can work really well. All right? Cancer Man, he's a boss type kind of man. You know, he's uh, very laid back. He's an observer. Uh, he's up in his head. He's mysterious. Gemini woman, she's out there. She's a go-getter. She knows what she wants. When she put her mind to something, she gets it. That's how she is. Okay? So this is a boss woman as well. So he's going to like the fact that, you know, she has a good head on her shoulder. She knows what she wants because he knows what he wants. Sometimes. Right? Um, Cancer Man is very sensitive. Uh, Gemini woman, not so much, okay? Um, she's impatient, he's patient, all right? And this is where they're going to clash, okay? So, you know, in the beginning, but, you know, Cancer Man, he could back off at any given moment, okay? He could back off, off at any given moment um, where he becomes silent, up, up in his head, don't want to be bothered. She could do the same thing. They could do it to each other, okay? But when he does it, right, you know, she's going to want answers, you know, why you just back off? We was having a good thing, you know, good conversation. Because, you know, these two... Um, she could touch, touch topics on anything, and he can too. And he's very much in the mind, and so is she. Okay, so, you know, um, this is where conversation flows. Is they're going to get along. But she's going to feel like she's giving more of herself um, opening up than he is, and which is going to complicate things. And then, especially if he back off without giving her notice, this is going to complicate things even more. Okay, Gemini woman is going to want to answer right away. The more she pushes uh, the cancer man, the more he backs off. Okay? Um, yeah, so, you know, she's very impatient when it comes to wishy-washy, but she could be wishy-washy as well. So, uh, it could reverse where, you know, she, you know, backs off and do her own thing, and Cassie Man, it felt like, okay, and he wants to answer. And, you know, she's not giving the answer, and the more he pushed, the more she, but... He's not going to worry. He need not worry about her verbalizing how she feels because Gemini woman always put on the front front. She puts it out there, what she wants, how she feels, and what she's looking for. He does not. Okay? Uh, another thing is Gemini woman, she's not she's not cheap. You know, she's very free with her money. She's very, you know, out there. You know, Cancer Man, on the other hand, he's very frugal and he can't withhold. Uh, especially emotions. Not only finances, but emotions. And this is going to stir her... Uh, because she's gonna feel like, well, where this, where is this going? But you know, they could argue one minute and then go to the bedroom and uh, fuck a hole in the ground. 
This is these two motherfuckers. They be, they're going to be fucking like monkeys, okay? Everywhere. In the kitchen, in the living room, in the bathroom, okay? Fuck it. On the elevator. You know, these are two nasty motherfuckers, okay? Yes, they are. All right? But um, in, in token, who's going to ground this relationship is going to be, listen, is going to be the cancer man, okay? Because once he's evolved, he knows what he wants, and if he's there, he's there, okay? Um, Gemini woman, she could be very direct when she say things, which can stir the cancer man emotions. But, you know, she's just a straightforward kind of person, and she just wants things out in the open, okay? And, you know, once he gets in this uh, state of mind, like, you know, uh, and backs off, that's it. Now, he could be the one looking at the Gemini woman like she's too out there, she's too free with herself, you know, um, very skeptical about her movements, which may cause him to rethink uh, the relationship or where this is going because she's here, there, and everywhere, okay? She's a mover and a shaker, all right? But one thing that he doesn't understand about the Gemini woman is that she doesn't allow everybody in her circle. Yeah, she's a conversationalist, uh, but she, she moves with the crowd, but she doesn't get lost in it. You understand what I'm saying? Uh, she knows how to move with the crowd. Um, so, again, you know, cancer man can teach her how to have more patience. If, you know, a lot of effective communication, a lot of trust has to be applied here. Okay? Effective communication and trust. All right? Because cancer man, uh, they could both be jealous of each other and possessive of each other. Yes, they both can. Okay? Because the sex is going to be so intense with each other. <laughs> Just so intense. Okay? With each other, fire alarms coming, going out in the apartment and shit. This, this, this is that type of relationship that 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 is just a make it or break it. But once they once they evolve and get together, they could do great things together because he's a go getter and she's a go getter. Okay, he's a hard worker and she's a hard worker. All right, but it's just getting past these obstacles of trust and and open communication, especially about feelings and where this is going and you know, not one shutting down and not verbalizing and this and this and pointing fingers and like that, like that, like that. Because this could get really ugly, ugly uh, between these two, okay? Because when Cancer Man comes back and say his piece, he gonna say his piece. And he get very nasty with what he says too, okay? And Gemini Woman will give it right back. And nothing is resolved at the end of the day. But then, you know, it's like a love-hate kind of relationship. So this could be, turn out to be a great long-lasting relationship or a fucked up and a toxic one, Okay? A fucked up and toxic one. Uh, you know, another thing is Cancer Man can play the field too. He can play a lot of games and, you know, be talking to Sally, Susan, you know, shit like that. Gemini Woman could do it too. They could do it to each other. Like, motherfucker, you want to play? Okay, let's play. You know, and this is not, this is just, this is crazy with the, it's like a love hate shit going on here. So when it breaks, it just breaks. When it breaks, it just breaks. Okay? Um,. Another thing that Cancer Man is going to appreciate about the Gemini woman, because although she's free and out there and this and that, she is a, a, a caretaker. She does take care of her man. She does take care of the home. She will cook. She will clean. Okay, she just uh, needs her freedom. Okay, he's more in the cut, homebody, you know, this and that. You know, she's more out there uh, doing her thing. Okay, so it's just a trust thing that has to be applied here, because you both could be looking at each other with a side eye, like, fuck you doing motherfucker you you point your fingers at me but what are you doing you know like that okay but in the long term they could really 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 um get to know each other and understand each other if they get there if because this can be a tiresome a lot of endurance has to be applied here a lot a lot a lot of fucking patience has to be applied but cancer man is definitely gonna like the outgoing spirit of the gemini woman because that's what balances him out okay he can be a little bit you know uh laid back boring stuff like that no she's gonna bring the spice of this relationship and bring bring him out of that shell which he is gonna enjoy <laughs> but then later on is gonna be jealous of because he's not gonna be trusting this movement and this often on mood swings that she could have and she's not going to be trusting his movement uh that he could display too because he's like a light switch as well okay they both could do it to each other so this can be sort of like a mirroring relationship but they have a lot to teach each other and they have 
if they could put their minds together, they could do great things together because they're both business minded and they both go-getters at the same time. And they both not gonna let each other fall. So where, you know, Gemini woman, she's free with her money, she wants to do this, but she's a saver at the same time. Listen, she's a saver at the same time. He's just frugal and with hope, and which is gonna catch her, or, you know, but who's gonna ground it is him. Because, you know, he looks for, once he's there, he's there. So he looks for long-term relationship, getting house, and this and that, building, building, building. Which is Gemini woman is gonna appreciate because she's here, there, everywhere, and she does need somebody to ground her, okay? But she does need her freedom at the same time. All right? But, um, yeah. And another thing is, is that Gemini woman will respect her cancer man. She will give him the leeway. Okay? But if he's leading her the wrong way, she's going to take back uh, and do things her way. Anyway, I have to go. I have to go. Part two coming up soon. I love you guys. I'm possible. You're possible. Girl, NC Tasha Ty. I'm out.